Hey everybody, how's it going? It's your man here, Kater85, and I am back for another uh, Game Jam Let's Play mini series, whatever you want to call it. Today we are uh, playing Pokemon Rose Gold, created by a fellow Minnesotan, Atomic Reactor, and uh, obviously this, I'm guessing this isn't any relation to Minnesota, uh, but this game, Pokemon Rose Gold, is, um, well, it, I know it's not related to Minnesota. <laughs> I don't even know why I said that. But, uh, yeah, so this was made for the Relic Castle Game Jam, and also, this is a short game, again, uh, one and a half to two hours long of, uh, you're pretty much playing as Red, and you're exploring the Tojo region, I think it is. Small region, I guess. I saw some screenshots. It looks really good, and I cannot wait to get into it. So let's go ahead and get into this, um, new game. Apparently not a lot of people have done it, but all right, so we are Just like that we're in um, So we're right in Mount Silver like this in our little hut I guess you know, yo, this is cool because we're in a, our hut in Mount Silver Like we're just this is where we live. Hmm, this is interesting. There's a note in the drawer Don't forget to let your Pokemon walked out by hitting control. Well, Oh, I don't even think we have any Pokemon, do we? Okay, we do! We have plenty of Pokemon. Hmm. I wanna see- oh god, what did I just do? Um, alright. Okay, there's our Pikachu. Oh, we already have the running shoes, so that's cool. Oh, yo, there's a wild Pokemon in here. Alright, so we have a gravel- level 51. Pretty good. Oh, we have Pikachu here. We'll go ahead and run. I've seen a lot of people using this. I think it's some kind of different version of EBS, or it might be an updated version of EB I mean EBS Elite Battle System that I that I'm not using. Um, but we have nothing here. Some barrels great for throwing at plumbers. <laughs> are, are we uh, are we trying to attack Mario? <laughs> Is the refrigerator barely anything in it? Obtain the lemonade. All right, I mean, that was helpful, right? Pail of water. What's this here? One light ball. Ooh. What's this on here? All right, so let's go ahead real quick. Oh, God. Yeah, this is cool. We've already got a lot of this stuff, so I'm going to go ahead and give a light ball to Pikachu. It's already holding the citrus berry. Yes, let's switch the two items. And, um... I am kind of tempted to use this Thunderstone right now. Um, I just want to see Pikachu's moveset, to be honest, real quick, before that. And we have, uh, we'll tackle, yeah, we're definitely using the, uh, the Thunderstone. Um, I'm sorry, but we're using it, what, Pikachu, yo, shoutouts to Atomic Reactor not letting you use the Thunderstone on Pikachu, that's pretty good. That's pretty good if I do say so myself. We have some heart scales, max repel, an iron ball, and Eevee light. Well, we could give Pikachu the Eevee light, but whatever. Let's go ahead. There we go. Let's go ahead and explore the outside. This is, music is kind of loud in my ears just because every RMXP music is, but I love this tile set. This is a really nice tile set. And the background. Uh, so mostly we just have Gravelers in here. I'm just going to go ahead and run. And get out of here. I'm gonna go ahead and we're definitely gonna be using a repel here. Um, we only have two, but we'll just go ahead and do it. And I'm gonna switch out my big boy Blastoise up here because Blastoise is by far my favorite, obviously. Um, and go ahead. Or would you like to surf? Blastoise, you surf. All right. Yo, this is cool. It looks a lot like Heart Gold. <laughs> I love how Blastoise is just following us behind. Found a Shell Bell, which is interesting. I definitely feel like I want to give that to someone. Um, I think we'll give it to, um, hmm. Let's give it to Snorlax since we don't, oh, it's already holding leftovers. Nah, then. Uh, I do kind of want to give it to maybe Charizard then. Holding an oh, wow. Actually, you know what, we're going to go ahead and take a look at our party real quick. Alright, we're going to go ahead and take a look at our party. We have Quick, Quick Claw, Citrus Berry, Leftovers, Amulet Coin, Light Ball, Manical Seed. Alright, so, uh, I think we'll give it to the, uh, 
Blastoise, maybe? Actually, no, not the Blastoise. Um, the Snorlax. No, not the... What was I gonna give it to? I had something in mind. Was it this? It was probably this, because it's holding a citrus berry. Let's give it... And let's go ahead and give it the shell, though. Because it's going to be dealing out a lot of damage here, obviously. So let's go ahead and switch the two items. I know we're just prolonging this series. Um, would you like to surf? Yes, let's go ahead and surf. I also have this, this speed hack open, but I, I don't really want to use it all too much. Actually, can I go ahead... Alright. So we can't toggle auto run in this game. At least not for now. We have a full restore here. Here we go. I also like how they... Okay, so blue's right there. Watch out. Here you go. I love these tiles. Oh my god. There's so much to explore. Oh, atomic reactor. Why did you... Okay. Yeah, you might want to fix that. Um... That's fine. It's fine, you know? I don't care. But, Atomic Reactor, you're actually killing me. There's so much to explore. What am I supposed to do? And then we have Mount Silver out here. Alright. Are you a trainer? Seen you around here a lot lately. Do you just live up here now to train? That's pretty daring. Apparently nobody wants to battle us. You know what? We're gonna run into blue right now, okay? This may be a bad idea, but you know what? I don't care. Here's blue. Hey, yo, red. Your mom said you might be here. What? Too afraid to come face me at my gym? That's okay. We can have a practice battle right here. Let's see how good you've gotten since our elite full battle. All right. So we have Gary Oak, blue, um, whatever you would like to call it. He's got a Pidgeot level 64. Maybe I should have let off with the Pikachu. Maybe this thing is Ice Beam, though. JK. Let's go ahead. Not into the bag. I love this so much. It's so perfect. Um, let's go ahead and go into Pikachu then. And uh, do the dang thing. God, it's so hot in here. I need my fan on, but I know that then it will bug up the... Uh, and it won't help. But anyways, we are Light Bulb Pikachu. I don't even know what Light Bulb Pikachu does. That's how much of a rebel I am. But let's go ahead Volt Tackle. Wing attack will do maybe a decent amount to us. Not going to do too much, though. And Volt Tackle should hopefully take this thing out as we're... Oh, God, that did a lot of damage. Down goes the Pidgeot. Oh, we got a ton of recoil on that. Last door is getting the experience. So does Pikachu. Rhyperior is going to be the next one in, and definitely we're going to go right into the Blastoise here because Surf the crap out of it will help us out. And, um... There he goes right here, here. Yo, look at these two monsters on the field. This is crazy. Alright, let's go ahead, Hydro Pump you. And we miss, of course, because why ever would a Hydro Pump hit for me? Ever. Why? But, yo, I love that speed falling too. This is all great. Can we hit the Hydro Pump this time? Thank you. The door is right there, Rhyperior. Alright? Just go. <laughs> but down goes the Rhyperior. Gain some nice experience. Um, and the Tailwind does peter out here. And Nido King is going to be the next Mon in. And uh, I kind of want to use one each. But I think we'll stay with Blastoise. You know, I was going to try to say. Alright, let's go one on one for each battle. You know, because that's how they did it way back when in the anime. But you know what? Too bad. Because we missed the Hydro Pump. Yet again, ladies and gentlemen, we missed the Hydro Pump. Can we Hydro Pump and hit it, please? No, of course we can't, because why would we ever be able to hit a Hydro Pump? Why would we ever be able to hit a Hydro Pump? Why would we ever be able to hit a god dang Hydro Pump? Can we hit this one, please? Thank you! Um... So there we go, down goes the Nido King, and we're gonna gain some nice experience. And Alakazam is gonna be the next one in. And, I mean... What's this thing's moveset? I feel like it might have Shadow Ball or something. JK, we don't have that. Let's go ahead and go into Snorlax then. Um. Oh, God. Oh, boy. Alright, anyways. Alakazam is gonna come on in here. And we're gonna go ahead and fight and... Yo, we have Crunch. Eh. <laughs> Guess what? We're gonna eat up your Psychic. 
I'm gonna take you out with our crunch. Get out. <laughs> bye bye Alakazam for sure. And uh gain some decent experience. I don't think this game is that much about gaining experience though, because we're already pretty high leveled, but Arcanine is gonna come in and we'll go ahead and switch in Blastoise, I guess. Um why not? Maybe it'll have E speed. If not, we might be able to outspeed it because we might be a higher level or so. Maybe we'll see though. Arcanine comes in level 64. We're four levels higher than it. We'll see if we outspeed. JK, it's got extreme speed and down goes the Blastoise. I'm fine with that. Um, I'm hoping there's like a Nurse Joy or something. That didn't even cross my mind till now. Anyways, let's go ahead and bring out Pikachu. Pika P. Because we can go ahead and hopefully take this thing out. Um, real quick with a Volt Tackle. Extreme Speed will do a decent amount to us. And Volt Tackle, we can go ahead and take down the Arcanine. But we might die to Recoil here. No, did we survive? Oh, I thought it said we survived on one. Anyways, let's go out here into the Espeon. Because we haven't seen the Espeon yet. How are you doing, Espeon? But then again, we haven't seen the Charizard or the Venus or either. But... Oh, God. Why? Why does... Why do you have to have such a disgraceful Pokemon? Like Umbreon. Umbreon is such a disgraceful Pokemon, you know? It really is. Anyways, Dark Pulse is gonna come on out. Yeah, I just noticed I don't have water. <laughs> oh god, I'm so dumb. Anyways, let's go ahead. I don't know. Does Umbreon have better physical or special defense? You know what? We're about to find out, god dang it. Flame to oh god, that... I was gonna say, Umbreon's a bit too bulky to be eating it that badly. Um, but I think, I think, I think I uh, well, J.K. I was gonna say, uh, we should be able to take it out with another flamethrower, but not anymore because uh, of the uh, citrus berry dark pulse. I'm hoping we can eat. We can, so that's good. And flamethrower should be able to take down it. this Umbreon. So bye bye Umbreon, and. Uh, I just noticed that Charizard is huge on our screen. Um, down goes Rival Blue. Very good. All right. Um, I'm wondering why it doesn't play the victory music, but that that's probably for something else. All right, Red. All right, Red. You win. You're stronger than me, and I have to admit it. I'll still be looking forward to you challenging my gym. Smell you later. Repel's effect wore off. Would you like to use another one? You. You are god dang right I want to use another one. Uh, but I do want to uh, heal up my Pokemon. And I think that hopefully in our little huts here, we will be able to do so. If not, that would be bad. But let's go into our little hut here. Um, I don't know if we can or not. Fill of water. This is our bed. Nope. Can't do it there. Alright. Interesting, but uh, we'll see. We'll see if blue. Uh, I'm wondering if this exit down here is actually an exit to the gym, um, or exit to the place because it kind of looks like it is. And we do have a Pokemon Center right here, so that's that. Oh, yo, this Pokemon Center looks pretty good. I do say myself, yo, and that f screen flash. That screen flash. That screen flash is what Pokemon needs to put in there. Uh, anyways, uh, we do... Oh, wow, we have some decent money here. Uh, I'm gonna definitely stop... Oh, God, we already do have Hyper Potions. Well, someone should have told me that. <laughs> and let's go ahead. Let's even you out at 20, and let's see... Oh, God, I didn't notice that we didn't have, like, any... We can only get... No, I'm gonna get one just because I'm OCD like that. And... How many full heals do we have? We have eight. All right. You know what? Good enough. Good enough. All right. And let's go ahead and see. Oh, sorry. I want to get that item. Amulet coin. All right. Interesting. Because we already have one on our Pokemon. Anyways. I actually don't think. Huh? This. I don't think this is like normal Mount Silver actually. So I guess we do have to go south. And we don't have any more repels, so you know what? Good luck to us. It's been fun. 
but uh, we may have to run into a wild Pokemon sooner than later. Okay, I guess we're meant to go up Mount Moon. I thought we were meant to go like uh, to Viridian City, but that that's not true, obviously. Cause why would we? So yeah. Anyways, um, Alpha Blastoise runs behind us while we're surfing. I wonder if it's just Water Pokemon. There's a Loungard here. Interesting because uh, it's, we're in Johto and Hoenn wasn't even released yet. But anyways, we're going to get up out of that wild battle and we're going to go right into Mount Silver. And we don't have any repels. That's right. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this will be fun, guys. Blastoise can come in. Um, Jeez, that entry animation takes so long. Alright, anyways, let's go ahead and um, go over here. Can we go north? So I do know how to get through Mount Silver. I'm just wondering if it's the same thing. I don't think it is because clearly, yeah, this must be like in the summertime. That's that's a cool addition to make the uh, to make Mount Silver like in the summer. I just want to see real quick. Do you have any Pokeballs? Yo, we do have Pokeballs. So we could catch a Clefable if we want to. Uh, but I'm guessing that fairy type isn't in this game because it doesn't look like the Gen 6 project is in here. Plus, it was made on like a two, uh, two thing, uh, timestamp. But anyways, let's go ahead and run here. That's weird. Oh, ooh, is that Faulkner? Is that Faulkner that I see? Interesting. Because if that is Faulkner, maybe we challenge him and beat him? Maybe? What do you have to say? Hmm, yeah, alright. Oh, hello, it's not often that I meet trainers up here. I'm a gym leader from Jet. Oh, I come up here to try. Suppose you can help me try a bit. Alright, well. Pikachu's about to destroy Faulkner, and Jesus, music is kind of low. I don't know if it's like, different, but. In comes Tropius. <laughs> Great, because obviously Blastoise is the perfect one for the job. Um, Let's go into Charizard, though. And uh, hopefully take this thing out with one or two flamethrowers or something like that. Um, but at least Storm shouldn't do much to us. Uh, but I do kind of like that. Um, that we have like two huge monsters on the field. I think that's really cool. Um, I also like how the HP bar is on their side. It's kind of, it's kind of, it's different, but I like it. You know. I love the UI. I don't know if this is custom just for this game. We'll see. Uh, Air Slash uh, hopefully won't be able to take us out here as it doesn't, so that's good. Flamethrower. Uh, oh, wow. He's going to actually withdraw. And he's going to actually send out Pidgeot here. Interesting. I'm going to... I will be happy with free damage on this Pidgeot. I think that uh, Flamethrower is still our best bet here. I'm wondering if that's going to be a two-shot, though, as it is. So that's good. Down goes to Pidgeot. I'm one. I'm also wondering if we're facing each of the uh, leaders. Um, but anyways, Salamence is gonna come in. You know, I think it's time for Espeon to see what we can do here. Uh, we should at least have Psychic. Yo, I just noticed that battle background. That battle background is really nice. It is. All right. Well, Intimidate's gonna come off. Um, and we can go ahead and just hit Psychic. Um, let's see how much that does. It doesn't do too much. It's actually got Fire Blast, but it misses. Um, but it does actually have Leftovers too, so this could be quite tedious. Um, we'll see. This should get it down to Orange, definitely. And Dragon Claw's gonna come out. I was gonna say, we should be able to eat one. But the Leftovers are really not doing us any favors here. I probably could have stayed in with Charizard and Dragon Claw here. There, I don't know why I didn't, but down goes the Salamence's special defense. Not like it'll help, but we do, we do actually have the Shell Ball. Just notice that, and it is gonna hit the Fire Blast. That should take us out, as it does. Sadly, but I'm okay with that. Um, I don't know. I might pause, just go back and heal, and then just keep doing that. I don't know why I didn't just keep Charizard in though. I don't know, but uh, Charizard will come out here. And we're going to go ahead and Dragon Claw you. And he's actually going to full restore this 
Salamence. It's a, good, it's a good thing we have a super effective dragon type move on our team. Um, these that's still not even doing that much damage. Do you give, do you give uh, Salamence multi scale in this game? <laughs> Yo, Salamence would be broken with multi scale. It would be broken with multi scale. I don't know why you're switching in Tropius. I'm just sacking it off, or not? We outspeed you. I don't, I don't know what this, this is. But down goes the Tropius, and um, that's that. Um, next is gonna be the Salamence, so we can go ahead and uh, do this, I guess. Um, yo, I love that uh, the animation, but the intent. Yo, that's what it. He did. He switched out to get the Intimidate. All right, I see you. I see you. Dragon Cloud's gonna do as much. Oh my God, it did. Salamence is a pseudo for a reason, ladies and gentlemen. Salamence is a pseudo for a reason, and we don't even have ice beams. You know what? Pikachu, it's your time, all right? It's Pikachu's time, all right? Catch this god dang volt tackle, all right? E speed. Interesting. Did a little bit of damage. Can we take you out, though? We do! Pikachu is a freaking legend in this game. I don't care. I don't care. We. I wish we could evolve it, though. Anyways, Braviary is going to be the next one in. I'm wondering why he's sending it in. It's probably going to outspeed us and, and be able to kill us. But I don't care. We're going to go ahead and actually outspeed and go for the Thunderbolt. That's a bye-bye for Braviary. Braviary is a f frail. Very frail, in fact. And we're getting some decent experience. And down goes Falconer, so there we go. Thanks for the intense training session. Well, he didn't really do that much, but... Anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and get this Ultra Ball here. And uh, we're gonna go run all the way back to the Pokemon Center. Oh, God, that's the only thing... That's the only thing that I found that isn't that good about this game so far, is that those little tiles. And I, and I get it because, like... I don't know. I get it, though. I get why you want to let the player be able to move on that space. But anyways, we're just going to go ahead and run. We need repels. Oh, I accidentally hit that. Wait, what? What did I just do? Okay, so no, no, no. That's cool. So with the A button, you can switch who's up front. So now you can choose up front. There we go. That's pretty cool. Cool if I do say so myself. Anyways, um... I see here a Tangela. Interesting. Um, yeah, I'd like to get in one more major storyline or battle or whatever. Um, hopefully with the money we earn from Falconer, we'll be able to uh, do something decent with uh, Super Repels. Um, so there we go. We restored your Pokemon to full health. Let's see here. Uh, if we can buy... Um, we can't even buy Repels. Oh, you sneaky, sneaky. Oh, God. Why? Why can't we? It's been up there for a while now. I know, I have been up there. Well, this will be fun. Um. Oh, God, what was that? That looks like a bee. Like a dumb bee. Not a smart bee, a dumb bee. There's differences, you guys. There really are differences. Uh, let's go ahead and run, obviously, from this point to... Um, so far, I'm really liking this game. Um, I want to see what happened though. What happens though when you get to the top of Mount Silver? Because I feel like that's what this game is. It's kind of like a journey to Mount to the top of Mount Silver. I'm wondering if we're gonna face all of the uh, all of the Johto gym leaders, or if Falconer is the only one. I don't know. There's so many questions yet to be answered in this game, and I love this game so much. So. Yeah, that's great. Anyways, uh, Arcanine is here. Pikachu is going to come on in. And we're going to go ahead and skedaddle up out. <laughs> you, 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 I'm sure you all thought that I was going to actually battle that Arcanine, didn't you? I know, I'm so sneaky, aren't I? So very sneaky. Yeah, I'm just saying after I finish recording this, I'm going to need to turn the fan on. Watch about an hour of tennis and then come back in and record. I kind of wanted to do this all in one session. I can't even do more than one episode, god dang it, because it's so hot in here. Anyways, there is a Fero up here. So, here we go, Pikachu. 
And as much as this would be great experience, I'm in fear, <laughs> get it, of the Firo outspeeding us. So we do actually find Wild Charge here, but I don't think there's anything else. Maybe that was just it. Hmm. Shinx, we can't go up there. Oh, God, I hate that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I keep messing up your game, Atomic Reactor. I don't really want to show that. Because that's really the only real flaw I've seen so far. But other than that, I don't even know if, if you meant it like that, it's good. I just feel that um, you're not supposed to go on that tile. I don't know. Oh, but... Mm, this repel. We, we need the repels. I wish we had more. Anyways, let's go ahead and get out of here. Uh, go back only level 47. Oh, wait. Uh, I didn't know there was a way up here. Anyways, Hariyama is here. I'm still waiting for that next major thing to happen. I'm not sure when it is going to happen, but we'll see. Run away from this Hariyama. I love how there's Hoenn Pokemon here. Right now, that water patch doesn't look like we can get anything. But I do kind of want to get this item here. Um... I don't know, if these Graveler were smart, they wouldn't let me run. Because I can't even touch them. Like, I know I have Iron... T Thank you! Oh. <laughs> Let's go ahead and uh, use that Max Repel, god dang it. Oh my god, my phone is going off. You guys probably heard that. Oh no! One of my favorite tennis players lost the first set. He's up and coming. No, I'm not worried. Question is, how far can you get over here? And can, can you get past? Can you get like an extra item maybe? We'll see. Ooh, so there is an exit right there. I would like to see though. Yo, there's a Master Ball? What? Hmm. Muy interesante. <laughs> Anyways, let's see. Okay, so there's two e exits. Um. Oh, so this is like the very... Yo, I love that. That's awesome. Those tiles. I don't know how they did this, but this is perfect. Atomic Reactor, you are a genius. This looks perfect. But I don't think that's the way to go. I don't think that's the way to go. So, that must mean that this way is the correct way to go. I just noticed we should check our TMs. We should check if we have any TMs. I'm guessing we don't. We do! Oh my god, we have quite a bit of TMs. Who can learn Earthquake? <laughs> like, ooh, who can learn Earthquake? Uh, definitely teaching that to Snorlax. I think that's probably the only mod we'll teach it to. Um, we'll get rid of... Ooh, we have Rest Talk here. Crunch and Rock Slide. So we really don't have anything Stab. I like the Crunch. Crunch came in handy, so I'm gonna keep it. I think that that'll be good. Uh, for now with uh, Earthquake. Uh, psychic, we'll see if anybody wants to learn Psychic here. Um, no. Alright. Let's see here. Thunderbolt. Let's see if anyone wants the Thunderbolt. Um, no. Alright. I like how Atomic Reactor, though, uh, if you're watching this, I like how you implemented, like, Red already has the substantial stuff, but I like how you didn't give us all the TMs because there, I like how you just gave us some of the good TMs, not all the useless TMs. So that's good. I like how you already gave us a party. Um, maybe that one tile error. I'm sorry, but I'll keep going over there. Um, but uh, the only other thing is that maybe just get the player some more max repels so if they're like me, they can explore a little bit more without running into wild Pokemon so there we go anyways let's go ahead and go out here um and we are in Silver Canyon North Auburn Town oh that's right we're in the Tojo region I just know we're in a different region I'm so dumb I also like how you didn't give us the choice of naming our character or just red I like that I like that but we don't have another repel so this is gonna be fun anyways we have a Sunflora here and we're gonna go ahead and send out Pika P. I wanna do that stupid voice crack thing that everybody does. Because it's so fun to do, but I'm not going to. So you know what? I'm not about to be that guy. Anyways, there's a Firo here. We're gonna go ahead and send in our Pikachu. And run from it. Like normal. 
Um, got away safely. And we're here with this guy. Chain her up in these parts. He must be tough. <laughs> you better bet I'm tough. I've completed the freaking Pokedex. Yo, I wonder if we have completed Pokedex. I should check that out. I know, I'm probably just ripping apart a ton of reactive, but if you did remember that, kudos to you. Kudos to you, because that, that's great. It's great if you actually show the completed Pokedex and stuff. I'm actually going to go out into Espeon. I was going to go out into Charizard, but I like Espeon more, you know? I like Espeon more. I'm going to see uh, Close Combat. We should be able to eat that. Hopefully decent. <laughs> but down go the defenses, and that's, that's good, because we can definitely... Uh, Take advantage of that with one little psychic up here. Um, get out. <laughs> I'm just saying, get out. But, uh, yeah, we're half an hour into this game, you know. It might be a three or four part series, we'll see, you know. Um, oh, that's right, we have the shell bell. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Anyways, Hitmonchan is gonna come in. You know, I don't know about you, just. I don't know, I just came to mind just because there's a Hitmonchan on the screen. I wish there was like a punch for every type, you know? Like a dark punch. That would that would help Hitmonchan out so much. Yeah, I see you on the level 66 grind. 666. There we go, but Shell Ball definitely doing its job. And uh Hitmon Top is gonna be the final mon. You have all the Hitmon Tops. I'm guessing that's your final mon. Yeah it is. So down, you go with a psychic, and uh, oh god, it survived. Interesting. Muy interesante. Oh, we should be able to eat up a close combat though from this thing. It's not, it's not a Hitmon Lee. It's not Bruce Lee. It's not Jackie Chan. And I don't know. I don't think Hitmon Top's supposed to be after anyone. <laughs> if it is, then well, sorry. It's definitely not good enough for me to know about it. <laughs> but then it goes to Hitmon Top. And there we go. Um, <laughs> I don't want to face any more... I, I, I don't want to face any more trainers in this episode. And uh, I'll just get as far as I can without facing any more trainers. So, yeah. Anyways, uh, hoping... There is a Pokeball here. A lucky egg? Ho ho! Oh wait. I think there's an event over here. So we're gonna wait for that to happen in the next episode. Because I know for sure there was a screenshot of something with their espions. You know what? We're gonna do that in the next episode. So if you guys enjoyed the first episode of Pokemon Rose Gold, make sure to mock much that like button. And of course subscribe if you guys have not. Uh, I will put the thread in the description, at least hopefully I will, um, and, uh, I'll, I'm, if I remember, I'll put Atomic Reactor's Twitter, uh, really cool guy, yeah, I just noticed that, you might almost turn around to see us, so I'm gonna end off the episode, or JK, are you a battler? No, I won't battle you, I'm just taking a leisurely stroll, just, sorry to have, ha <laughs> ha, you're hilarious, anyways, yeah, this is definitely gonna be the end of the episode, so I'm going to get up out. This is Katerade5 signing out. Thanks for watching, everybody, and have yourselves a good day.